Hello, I'm Leanne Spar. In this section, we will discuss simple interest and how principal, rate, and time are related to simple interest. The topics we will cover in this section are we will find the principal, we will find the rate, and we will find the time. Now let's look at the formulas that we will use in this section. Using the basic simple interest formula, we see that the principal, P, equals to interest divided by rate times time. We will see that rate, R, equals to interest divided by principal times time. And we'll see that time, T, equals to interest divided by principal times rate. Now we will do an exercise in which we will find the principal. If the rate is 6%, the time is 24 days, and the interest is $6.24, then the principal is equal to interest divided by rate times time. So the principal will be the interest, which is $6.24, divided by the rate, which is 6%, multiplied times the time, which is 24 days out of 360, using ordinary interest here. So the principal will be $1,560. Now let's do an exercise in which we find the rate. The principal is $15,600. The time is 90 days. The interest is $312. The rate is equal to interest divided by principal times time. So the rate will be $312 divided by principal, which is $15,600, times time, which is 90, divided by 360. This fraction is equal to 0 0.08, 8 one hundredths, or 8%. So our rate here is 8%. Now let's take a look at two problems in which we find the time. Here we'll find the time in days. The time is equal to interest divided by principal times rate. So finding the time in days, if the principal is $20,000, the rate is 8%, and the interest is $1,200, the time will be 1,200 divided by 20,000 times 0 0.08, which is 0.75. So the time is 75 one hundredths, or 3 fourths. Time is always in years. So we want the time in days. So in days, we have 3 fourths of a year times 360 days. Remember, we're using ordinary interest here. And that turns out to be 270 days. So the time in days is 270 days. Now let's find the time in months. The time again, is interest divided by principal times rate. The principal is $8,400. The rate is 7 and 1 fourth percent. The interest is $357. So the time will be 357 divided by 8,400 times 7 and 1 fourth percent is 0 0.0725. We calculate this fraction, we get 0.5. 8, 6, 2 years. Remember, time is always in years. We were asked to find time in months, so we multiply 0.5862 years times 12 months in a year, and we obtain 7.03 months. 7 and 3 one hundredths months. In this section, we discussed finding principal, rate, and time with simple interest. Now go and do some of these problems on your own.